Okay, after the disaster with the Luku mothers, we're gonna make chicken drumsticks today, rice, and some veggies. Let's say we never did complete meal, right? Dinner. So let's do that. It's easy, you come back from work. What do we do? I defrost this, but these have little work though. I'm not gonna put it with a, uh, with a skin. I go like this and it comes out like that. We need the chicken, oregano, Old Bay, a lemon, olive oil, pepper, and salt. Old Bay is the best ingredient in all it. this. When you go to a restaurant, if you order chicken wings with Old Bay, it's really good and it's not messy either. Like when you get it with barbecue sauce and I then it gets everywhere. It goes with a fish, mm -hmm. shrimp. I love Old Bay in the shrimp. This is big drumsticks though. Yeah. Make sure your hands is clean with a chicken. Don't I wash it good. But just explain how you're cutting it. You see you're I spinning, just go around, I go spinning around, the drumstick I go around. around. Yeah. and you're holding the knife in place to yes. cut Otherwise. an opening so that you can pull the skin off. There you go. A uh, quarter of a cup. Wait, what are you putting in there? Uh, I'm gonna, I decide to put a little wine. It doesn't matter, any Pinot kind of grease. wine. Pinot and, and You know what grease means in um, Spanish? Okay, no. Gray. Okay, so that will give a little... Interesting. Yeah, interesting. Now, I'm going to put the lemon, okay, another one. Always season your food like meat before you cook it. Never just put it on after like oh, a no. garnish. Yeah. That was my mistake for a long time. Oh, really? I would make, yeah, rice and okay. or uh, bell peppers um, and put it on afterwards. So it's like a coating of dust on your food. Now how get this out? Ah. Oh. Oh my goodness. You're gonna oh, rip the whole thing quiet. off. I'm gonna put um, Old Bay now. Okay, I think we are okay. Are you gonna get it on both sides? No, it's fine. Well, at least get it on the one side. You missed this one, you missed that oh. one, you missed that one. Now we're gonna put a little bit of pepper. I love pepper, but I'm not gonna put, I don't want it to. Hot. And the salt because I don't I'm gonna do it like this. I'm not gonna put that much. It's sea salt. Such a simple recipe, but it's but really good. It, yeah, it's really, really good, trust me. Very good. Now I'm gonna put this back. Oh, I have to put the olive oil. I forgot you should put the olive oil before, but that's okay, that's fine. Just like that, okay, and I don't, <clears throat> my God, I feel like I want to sneeze. Okay, I think it's baptized pretty good. Now oregano, oh. I love oregano and the chicken. Okay. Let's get some on that drumstick, yeah. Well. Oh, this, these drumsticks are big. Okay, I think we are pretty good. And I'm gonna put a little bit water in the bottom. Otherwise, it won't cook. Okay, don't put it on top. Just like that. And they say, oh, but have it in a rack? No, it's gonna dry. Let me see. Yeah, a little more. Okay, and now, that's it. We'll put it in the oven, 350, probably an hour. And that's it. In a few minutes, we're gonna do rice. Let me put it all together. You can do anything with it. You can do pasta, you can, ah, right now, we do rice. We're gonna make rice, 
and we rinse it off the rice, okay? We have to because I like to go like this, clean. It gets the starch off it. Yeah. And it's basmati rice for this time. See, look, see the, 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 the water is kind of white, cloudy. Mm -hmm. And I'm gonna do it one more time. Okay. We're gonna uh, make um, rice and I'm gonna put a scallion, whatever, put green what? onions, green onions, scalia, I mean scalia, whatever. Why'd you put the other ones down there in the sink? Because I washed it. I just clean up. Ew, the, the sink's single. dirty. No, I washed it. Nope. No. You're cutting these all wrong. No, I'm not. I can do whatever I want. That's my kitchen. I don't know. Green onions, it's very tasty. Spring onions, whatever you call them. And they give a uh, good taste. Yeah, I like them. Alright, let me get the other one. Because... Oh. I just shampoo. I just soak. Doesn't matter. And you don't want me touching no. food with my hands, but no, you're don't. willing to put it. It's like putting it in the bottom of a storm drain. No, no, no. Don't cut them too small, too thin, because they, these guys are melting. I'm going to put olive oil and a little butter and saute the onions, okay? Olive oil. Thank God for olive oil. Don't be afraid. I'm gonna put half of that, okay? I like to do this. <laughs> we're gonna let this melt, you know, and get hot a little bit. Then we're gonna put the onions. Then we're gonna put rice, little salt, little pepper. Mix it up, we'll put the water, let it simmer for what? 10, 15 minutes? Basmati rice is really good. I put one cup rice, two cups water. And if you need more, well, we put more. Okay, this little bird here starts smelling good. Our butter and oil, olive oil is hot. So I'm gonna put all the onions there. You like this rice, don't you? Mm -hmm. I, I think it's really good. Yeah. And if you want cheap rice, either, first of all, you can go to Dollar Tree and actually get decent rice there, good rice for a dollar. Or um, I recommend going to Oh, I said going weird. Ethnic grocery stores. Like around here, we have H Mart. You can buy giant sacks of rice. Huge bags of rice, almost like sacks of it, like burlap sacks of it. So it's really big. But uh, you can get those at ethnic grocery stores like H Mart or um, Arab markets, I guess, or African markets. They have one around here, Grand Market. I love Drinking it. wine. Mmm. It's good for my allergies. <laughs> I'm over 21. I have a birthday three, four days ago. Yeah. Oh my God, they smell good already. And we went to this place, the Yaila Bistro. Oh boy, this place is good. We should go there one time. Oh, I have wine, I have, it was really good. I have lamb, skewer, you know, like a kebab. Oh boy, it was good. The rice is washed. Oh my God, this is good rice. So we're gonna put it in like that. Okay. Uh, and we're just gonna do that few minutes. Not few minutes, just a few seconds. So it gets coated. We're gonna put the water, two cups water. One cup. Two cups, little pepper. See, it's not kinda simple, plain, you know. Okay, and a little bit of salt. I like to do that because if you keep putting salt, with, and I think we are okay. We're gonna cover this. just like that and I'm gonna check it in five minutes okay on you put your water in salt and pepper don't stir just leave it like that why I, I don't know it comes up better I don't know why 
We're going to saute some peppers, red pepper and orange pepper. Bell peppers. Bell peppers with garlic and olive oil. So it goes good with the, uh, with the rice. Ooh, take all that skin out from the inside. That hurts my stomach. Oh, really? I think so. I've heard that's that'll hurt people's stomach. It's hard oh. to digest or something. Okay, I'll cut it soon, so yeah. All right. Make sure dry your pepper a little bit so it doesn't splash. Okay. I cut that. Okay. I mean, cut your bell peppers in a weird way. No, it's fine. I don't want them too thin because they're not gonna. I like them thin. Oh, well, okay. And God, oh my God, pepper with garlic and olive oil is good. Mmm. And another one. Oh my God, I'm glad I have these peppers. Yeah. Okay, get the seeds out. A little bit more, hold on. Oh, you weren't out. Okay, now pull them off. Okay, it will be done soon. I want to put the garlic powder. Don't be afraid. That's make it good. Oh, that's a bit gonna be good. Okay, oh my god, that's good. No. All right, this is done. We turn it off and we let it sit for a few minutes until we check the chicken. It's over an hour, although the drumsticks take time. All right, uh, our chicken is cooking one and a half. Uta, what is that? It's hour and a half, these uh, drumsticks that were big. We're gonna take it out because we don't have Time looks like oh looks good huh I like this rice a lot oh yeah it's really good good rice it's basmati rice and I like bell We're peppers gonna put the peppers we can do you uh, bell peppers hold on let's fix it nice and like that and put just few on top on the rice okay. Oh, wow, wow, wow. Okay, guys. This rice is to die for. Mmm. Oh, my. Oh, my God. Maybe I get this one. Yeah. Perfect. Mmm. It's really... Mmm. The spices, the wine, the olive oil, whatever we put it. Oh, my God. It's delicious. Like, subscribe. Um, support Angelo on the, what the? Patreon. The Patreon. Let us know how you like it, but it doesn't cost much. It's really good. It's tasty. And instead to do only drumsticks and show you how we do it, we did the whole meal. And you don't need anything else. Okay? Leave a comment. Yeah, leave your comments. And who knows, someday we'll do the Lucumadas. That was a disaster yesterday. Everybody left a comment saying you can't put boiling hot water that. in it. Let me. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Everybody left a comment saying you can't put boiling hot water in the yeast. It kills the yeast. Yeast right. is like bacteria. It should rise after the 10 minutes with the warm water. So next time we're going to try that. We're going to do it again. I knew that in the way because over heated yeast, it doesn't go anywhere but anyway our focus right now is in this meal this is delicious this is good the chicken is not boring i can tell you that all right okay i'm good next time go ahead i'm gonna give you some stuff okay mm -hmm. and then i'm gonna put the chicken back because like we gotta get going here if you can ah <laughs> 